What's up guys, welcome to another video on my channel. So today I'm going to show you all the new feature of Filmora 13.4.1. Okay, so after watching this video, you can decide to upgrade to this version or not. Okay, maybe not because I don't think it is a good update because many interesting features here are just related to paid effect and annual subscription. So maybe it is not good for a perpetual user or lifetime user like me and many other people here on the internet. Okay, so let's go to my computer screen. All right, so first thing first, we have the new dynamic subtitle, something like this, okay. So this is an example. What's up guys, welcome to another video on my channel. So, so you see that we have a subtitle here and we have some emphasized words in my subtitle. So in order to do this this subtitle, it is not as normal, okay? So we can delete this one. We need to use the speak to text option in Filmora 13. For example, I have a video here. What's up guys, welcome to another video on my... So what's up guys, welcome to another video. Now if I want to create a subtitle for this part, I can select it and then I can select this option is the speak to text option okay just click it and remember if you want to use this text to speak or speak to text option you have to have AI credit if you have a perpetual plan maybe you have 2000 AI credit and if you are running out of AI credit you have to purchase the pack from Wondershare and if you want to use unlimited AI credit you have to purchase an annual plan or a cross-platform plan so you want to purchase a plan of Femora, don't forget to use my 20% discount in the description, okay? So for example, now I want to translate this, this part of the video into subtitle. So now we have a new option here, add automatic or active words. So we can just click here and then we can click OK to transcribe my voice into subtitle, okay? It is doing the job. Okay, it is completed now. So let's close it. And now we have a new subtitle file here. So this is the What's first What's up guys, one. welcome and to another video another on my video? channel. So today we're going to talk about copyright strike and how So now we can edit this subtitle by double click at the subtitle. Okay, and then we can select title and we have the template here, they have seven new template here for us to choose for example we can select this one or this one just click here to see the chance what's up guys welcome to another video on my channel so today we're going to talk okay and if you want to edit the text inside edit the active word and the color words or stuff like that you have two options the first option is to click here at this edit button or you can just click here at the basic option and now you can select the emphasize word right here also. For example, if I want to emphasize the words another video, I can just highlight it and then I can click emphasize, okay? Or I can merge it. If I, I click merge it, it will be two color, okay? Two word with the same color, okay? For example, we can select another video like this and then click emphasize, okay? And next up, we have the active words and keyword, by the way, I have no idea why we have two separate words here, active words and keywords. For the active word, we can change the forms and the size, and also we can change the color. This is in green, and we can change it to yellow, okay? And down here, we have the keyword, okay? So keyword is the other word in the center, okay? Not the emphasize word. So for the keyword, we can do the same, change the forms and the size and also the color. And then we can click apply to all and apply and see, see what is going on here. Okay. What's and up guys, click. welcome up to here? another video on my channel. So today we're going to talk about. So we are going to talk about copyright. So this is the keyword and this is the active word. So maybe <laughs> there's messing up. They are just messing up with keyword and active words. I have no idea why we should have two two kind of words right here. By the way, that is how you can add and edit the dynamic subtitle in Filmora 13.4. Okay, so that is the first new feature. And remember, you have to have AI credit to use this option because you have to 
use the speak to text option in Fimora 13 and it costs AI credit. And then after that, you can check the box at automatic dynamic subtitle and to have this subtitle. Okay. And click apply to on and apply because you see that the color of the this subtitle is different from this normal subtitle. For example, I can just go back to okay, just double click here, go back to a normal title, and then I can select this one. I can drag and drop this one on the timeline. You see that this is the dynamic subtitle, it is in green, and this is the normal title, it is in blue. Okay, and that is the first new feature. By the way, we go to the next one, which is the audio driven text effect. Okay, so you see here we have the audio driven text effect. I have a title here, but actually we have no effect related to this audio driven text effect. We have to use a paid title template of Femora 13 to have the audio driven text effect. Okay, so we have to delete this one and go to the title tab and then go to the title template and then we have the audio driven text effect right here. But you see here, these are all the paid effects. We have the pinky diamond button. If you have a perpetual license of Filmora without film stock subscription plan, you cannot use this audio driven text effect. For example, I can drag and drop it here. It will be, there will be a notification window. Okay, to achieve more rhythm text, okay. And you see here, enjoy Filmora creative access for free. It is not for free. It is 99 US dollar one year. Okay. So I want to go back to edit and here we can see. It is not just about the view. It is about the channel that I'm. Audio driven zoom. So we don't have any effect here. By the way, it is the second new feature in Filmora 13.4. Okay. And let's come to the next one with the voice changer effect. So the voice changer effect, it is right inside our video property. You want to access to the voice changer effect. You want to just double click at the video and that you see like audio and we have the new tab here, voice changer. Okay. And we have voice filter and voice character. So they are just the audio effect. We previously have, have them in the, the effect tab. By the way, we can select echo, for example. But we need to download. What's up, guys? Welcome, Welcome to, to another, another video. video. Okay, and then I can change it to lobby on my channel. So today we're going to talk about. And I can adjust the level of the effect also. Ten, mean one hundred percent. So today we're going to talk about. Okay, and we can select the voice character, to hacker and mail. Oh, on my channel. So, so today we're going to talk about Mail Minion oh, on my channel. So today we're going to All right, so that is the third new feature in Filmora 13.4. And the next one is about the change in the stock media. Okay? So let me show you about this. So normally in Filmora 13 and older version of Filmora when we click stock media. Not this one. Okay, so this one is just a built-in library. And we have some partner here with Pixel, Jiffy, Pizza Bay, and Unsplash. Whenever we select a partner here, we will have a bunch of different video here and we can find them. So it is very easy to just drag and drop them onto the timeline. By the way, now they change the way they display the video from partner. So for example, if we want to have a video on Pixel and Jiffy or Pixel Bay, we need to select it. And now it will redirect us to their partner website. And the most annoying thing here is the website is in Chinese. How can it, how can we read the website in Chinese? Okay, let's click confirm and go to bitsapay.com.zh. You see, everything is in Chinese. So maybe we can go back to bitsapay.com to have an English version. That's right. I have no idea why they just put the link in the partner website and they put it in Chinese. So maybe for Chinese on only, not for international user like me. Okay. And that is um, the website we can download free stock image and free stock video and stuff like that. So it is a little bit different. Okay. And it is the same with Pixel. 
So we can click confirm to go to a uh, uh, Vietnamese. What the, what the hell? I have no idea why it go to Vietnamese. So maybe we have to go back to pixel.com. Okay, again, it is still Vietnamese. Okay, so that is the change number four in Filmora 13.4. And finally, they group the AI tools into a box, which is the AI box, right at the start page of Filmora. Okay, so let me show you where it is. Okay, so we need to go back to the start page, return to startup window and click save. Okay, and this is the startup page of Filmora 13. And now we have a new AI toolbox here. Just click here. And you see, we have screen recorder. Which is not AI, please. It is just a screen recorder, okay? AI text to video. We can create video from text. AI text by editing. I never use this, okay? Because I want to edit according to the sound, not the text, so I never use it, this one. Silent detection, which is the tool to help you find silent in your video, okay? Avatar presentation. You can present yourself in front of the camera like this and Filmora will create a version of you in animated video, okay? Like this, have a character and then presentation, okay? AI copywriting is similar to ChatGPT. You can ask AI to write a title for you, write a script for you, okay? All right, so that's everything you want to know about Filmora 13.4.1. And to be honest, I still think that you don't need to upgrade to this latest version if you don't need the dynamic subtitle effect because it is something that we have to buy an AI credit to use the speak to text and then we can use the dynamic subtitle. So that's everything for today's video. I hope it is helpful for you. If you have any question, just let me know at the comment section below. If you're new here, consider to subscribe to my YouTube channel for more video like this. And to watch more video, just click here or to subscribe right here. Bye. And see you again. Okay. Bye. Shh. Bye-bye. <laughs>